Hello everybody and welcome to our gaming webinar today. My name is Samuresan and I work as a gear card manager at Kuma. So today we are going to focus on gaming and playing with Kuma Sono Hedge. So at first few words about Kuhaso. So as you know, Kuhasono is is a USB mouse that can be controlled with your head movement. It includes Kuma Sono device here and a USB receiver. The basic functionality is that you just plug USB stick inside computer port and press on and then you can move the cursor, mouse cursor on your screen. So that is really, really basic functionality of Kumaso. And on top of PC, you can use smartphones or tablets also, but in that case, you most likely need some kind of adapter cable and you can, you can click the USB receiver here, put your sizes here, and then you can just plug it into your Android device, or you can also have adapter for Apple devices. So that's the basic functionality of Kuma Sano headphones. Mm, then, next very important item in gaming is how to make mouse click. Because well, yeah, every game probably has some kind of clicking, so that's one thing that we will also focus on this presentation. So today I have this Kuma Sono with Sendo Puff Switch Arm. So basically this one is custom designed for this Sono device. So you will add it to your Sono and just go ahead and move the Puff sensor in front of your mouth and then you can make left mouse click with Puff. This is very handy in many cases because you don't have to use your hands at all. Uh, we also have other possibility in the Zeno. In our USB receiver, you can see there's always this 3.5 millimeters plug. You can add here a switch. For example, we also have in our stock is this kind of switch. It has, it is a switch and it has 3.5 millimeters plug and you can plug it to your USB receiver and plug to your PC and then it, it is the, you can make more switch with this one. You can also put here an adapter which divides this to two and there's a left click and right click for this. And one very important item for you to notice is that you can use any switch which has this 3.5 millimeter block. For example, you may have a pocket switch, you may have an iPlink switch, you may have touch switch switch, or you may you can have zip pop switches or whatever. So basically, this is not limited to UHA products only. This is universal, you can plug here the switch and make click and this is something that you need to check with your customer or user or what is the best solution of the person okay then few words about today's videos um, i have five different example example videos for you. I'm using this setup. I have Kuha Sono plus this Sento buff switch. I selected the game so that it, it works extremely well with this. So uh, I will put the videos go online and I will explain also also what happens during the game and what I'm doing. Okay, let's start first. Uh, I have three PC videos and then two Android device videos for you. Okay, let's start. Okay, 
Here you can see my head. I'm using the Kuha. Um, I have I have so and box switch. So in this game, uh, this is kind of a driving game. This is this game is available from Special Effects UK website. So this is very good example of how to use Kuha Sono to steer this see space rocket or whatever it is. So actually you can see my head movement, the, the ship will turn left and right, it follows my movement. And if I, you can see the curse there, and if I move my head up, it accelerates and down it breaks. So this is very easy to play, just plug and play. You don't need anything, plug the device in and that's it. It's very, and it doesn't take long to learn how to play this. It's very straightforward. And in this game, you don't need any clicking inside the game. Of course, the menus you can use the clicks. Okay, next video is a user video from one of our Uva Zona users. This person is very enthusiastic gamer, gamer and loves to play with our device, and loves gaming. And uh, here you can see the guy has a uh, Zono and bus switch and uh, he's actually using all those menus by, by himself and yeah, he has also a headset later on. But uh, here yeah, this person plays a game called Batman and here we go. It's not that close to the sun. As you can see, I can play. Uh, I'm not familiar about this game, so I don't know how to play. And so, <laughs> so the, this guy, this guy actually knows better. And this video explains itself that how to play. So this is a, this is this is a fighting game. So as you can see the user don't need any other things that's a really beauty of this device okay so soon will be happening next video okay this is one of my favorites so I've been playing this game <laughs> uh, this game called Civilization. So this game is a strategic game. The aim is to build your own world or empire. And you start from scratch, you build the first city and then you expand and expand. So this is the basic idea of, it, of this game. And why I selected Kuha Zone here is because this game is it's a uh, it can be controlled completely with mouse. So basically this is perfect game for Kuha Sono and tricks are done by center as you can see from a small picture. I'm using the cursor moving moving my units and building cities and developing technologies and whatever it includes in this game. And uh, it's very easy and straightforward to start playing and uh, as this is so-called turn-based strategic game, this work, uh, Kuha Sono works very very well for this. And this is also very famous around the world. Gamers know this game very well, so this would be excellent opportunity for a person who cannot use arms for some reason to, do, to use Kuha Sono for this. It enables a lot and this is very nice. Nice computer game. So you see I, can, I, I don't use my hands at all. But I can just pop and make it work. I can select everything with mouse click which I do with my mouse. I want to do the same thing. Okay. Then just a minute now. We have next video. Then I have a few videos, tablet, Android tablet. Here you can see how I attach the receiver to tablet. 
and put one of on and here you can see cursor follows a movement and I will select whatever game I want. And here is an example game for Android tablet is Class of Clans. This is also a very famous strategy game. And here would I I can control everything also with my head movement and make this clicks with Sento. This is also very interesting, very game that should go switch very well. But so now. Okay, then the last video. It's a Android device, Android phone on my phone. <laughs> uh, I just similarly attach the receiver and so on there and put on device and adjust the mouthpiece close to my mouth to be able to make this mouth clicks and here you can I select him there. This game is called Bubble Booster or what it's kind of you blow up bubbles here so as an example many menus but <laughs> I can control those easily with this bus itself. So this is a very good example how you can use also with your smartphone and it's easy, it works very easily. And here you can see I aim with my head and then I puff and then it throws the ball and Actually, I enjoy very much playing with this with with Kuhasa. It's quite nice. Okay. So this is the last video what I have, and then let's go. Okay. So this was. Uh, everything what I have prepared for you today and basically in principle Kuhasono it enables a lot you can play many many different games which you can normally or normally, normally you can play with which are actually mouse controlled you can play a lot of different games so now the questions what do we have questions yes so we do have a couple of questions so the first one can i play any game with kuhasono basically as i said uh, games uh, with mouse control are typically games that you can play directly so that is kind of well, say limitation but that is the games you should focus on games that you can directly play with normal mouse these are pretty often very straightforward to use okay and is there a list of games that are compatible with kuha mice well as you know the world is full of games and every device, PC and uh, Android Play stores, there's so many different games that we haven't even started to prepare any kind of list. But as I said earlier, games that you can play with your normal mouse, should, you should be able to play those directly with Kuhat So Only thing what you need to really think about is how to make the click that causes you need to figure that out that what are your abilities to the click do you need a bus switch or what okay and then question are the games free so i guess this is more about the games you demonstrated yeah, yeah basically all of the all those games that i demonstrated are free but uh the civilization uh, I'm using the demo version, so basically the demo is free, but <laughs> of course not the real version. So if you really want to play, you should buy it. And I selected the games in, in a way that would be free or would visualize what can you do. But 
as you know, games are game business is business, and uh, most likely there are some ways that you quite often need to pay money one way or the other. But with free games, there's also a lot of opportunities. Okay. okay. And then a question about jesters. Can I use jesters with games? Uh, actually, I will recommend that you, the jesters would be turned off because you don't want to play in the game that you can. You may make, you may do a jester that for like a pause is the course of just and you don't know what to do. What what's the root cause? So that's why you should turn the jesters off before before playing. Okay, and then is it possible to left and right click with Sonar? Uh, in center, what I showed here, uh, there's only this, you have one left click button, but as I show, showed you, there's this adapter, so you can put to receiver and put two different buttons. Then you can make left hand, right, right click. So it depends also on your setup that how you say if you have zip bus switch or you have two two external external buttons or what is the way how you use it. Okay, any other? That was the last question. Okay. Okay, so thank you everybody for joining this webinar and I really hope that you will you will share this with your colleagues and friends to really share this information that gaming is also one thing that you can do with Zono Headmacos. So please share this information. This will be also available after this after this webinar online so you can share it after that. And last thing in my list is hey next webinar mid May will be about working with head mouse. So that will be the middle of May. So welcome also there. So thank you very much for joining and bye.